Robert Michels, German, Mackels, the 9th of January 1876, Cologne, Germany, the 3rd of May 1936, Rome, Italy, was a German-born Italian sociologist who contributed to elite theory by describing the political behavior of intellectual elites. He belonged to the Italian school of elitism. He is best known for his book Political Parties, published in 1911, which contains a description of the Iron Law of Oligarchy. He was a friend and disciple of Max Weber, Werner Sombart, and Achille Loria. Politically, he moved from the Social Democratic Party of Germany to the Italian Socialist Party, adhering to the Italian revolutionary syndicalist wing and later to Italian fascism, which he saw as a more democratic form of socialism. His ideas provided the basis of moderation theory which delineates the processes through which radical political groups are incorporated into the existing political system. Topic biography Michels born to a wealthy German family, studied in England, Paris at the Sorbonne, and at universities in Munich, Leipzig 1897, Halle 1898, and Turin. He became a socialist while teaching at the University of Marburg and became active in the Social Democratic Party of Germany for whom he was an unsuccessful candidate in the German federal election, 1903. In Italy, he associated with Italian revolutionary syndicalism, a leftist branch of the Italian Socialist Party he left both parties in 1907. He achieved international recognition for his historical and sociological study, Zur Soziologie des Partisans in der Modernen Demokratie. Untersuchungen über die oligarchischen Tendenzen des Gruppenlebens, which was published in 1911. Its title in English is Political Parties, a sociological study of the oligarchical tendencies of modern democracy. In it, he presented his «Iron Law of Oligarchy» theory that political parties, including those considered socialist, cannot be democratic because they quickly transform themselves into bureaucratic oligarchies. Michels was considered a brilliant pupil of Max Weber, who began publishing his writings in the Archive für Sozialwissenschaft und Sozialpolitik in 1906 and appointed him as co-editor in 1913, but they disagreed over Michels' opposition to World War I. Michels criticized what he perceived to be Karl Marx's materialistic determinism. Michels borrowed from Werner Sombart's historical methods. Because Michels admired Italian culture and was prominent in the social sciences, he was brought to the attention of Luigi Inaudi and Achille Loria. They succeeded in procuring for Michels a professorship at the University of Turin, where he taught economics, political science and socio-economics until 1914. He then became professor of economics at the University of Basel, Switzerland, a post he held until 1928. In 1924, he joined the Fascist Party, led by Benito Mussolini, former director of the Italian Socialist Party's newspaper Avanti. Michels was convinced that the direct link between Benito Mussolini's charisma and the working class was in some way the best means to realize a real lower social class government without political bureaucratic mediation. In 1928, he became professor of economics and the history of doctrines at the University of Perugia and occasionally lectured in Rome where he died on May 3, 1936. Topic writings Syndicalisme and Socialisme en la Magna Unionism and Socialism in Germany 1908 Proletariato e la Borghesia nel Movimento Socialista Italiano The Proletariat and the Bourgeoisie in the Italian Socialist Movement 1908, 1975 Zur Soziologie des Partisans in der Modernen Demokratie Untersuchungen über die oligarchischen Tendenzen des Gruppenlebens on the sociology of the oligarchical tendencies of modern democracy 1911, 1925, 1970. Translated, as Sociologia del Partito Politico nella Democrazia Moderna, Studi sul Tendenz Oligarchische degli Aggregati Politici, from the German original by Dr. Alfredo Paledro, revised and expanded 1912. Translated, from the Italian, by Eden and Cedar Paul as Political Parties, a sociological study of the oligarchical tendencies of modern democracy Hearst's International Library Co., 1915, Free Press, 1949, Dover Publications, 1959, republished with an introduction by Seymour Martin Lipset Crowell Collier, 1962, Transaction Publishers, 1999, ISBN 0-7658-0469-7, online at archive.org. Translated into French by S. Jankilovich, Les Partis Politiques. Essay sur les tendances oligarchiques des démocrates, Brussels, Editions de l'Université de Bruxelles, 2009 ISBN 978-2-8004-1443-0
Grenzen der Geschlechtsmoral Boundaries of Sexual Ethics. Italian translation, Morale Sessuale revised and expanded by Alfredo Paledro Fratelli Boca, 19. Translated as Sexual Ethics, a study of borderland questions Walter Scott, George Allen and Onwin, Charles Scribner's Sons, 1914, republished with a new introduction by Terry R. Candle Transaction Publishers, 2001-2, ISBN 0-7658-0743-2 Probleme der Sozialphilosophie, Problems of Social Philosophy 1914, Imperialismo Italiano, Studi Politico-Demografici Italian Imperialism, Political and Demographic Studies, 1914, Amour et Chastete, Essays Sociologiques, Love and Chastity, Sociological Essays, 1914, Organizzazione del Commercio Estero, The Organization of Foreign Trade, 1925, Socialismus und Fascismus in Italian, Socialism and Fascism in Italy, 1925, Storia Critica del Movimento Socialista Italiano, Dogli Inizi Fino al 1911, Critical History of the Italian Socialist Movement, La Voce, 1926. Corso di Sociologia Politica First Lectures in Political Sociology 1927 Translated, and introduced by Alfred de Grazia, as First Lectures in Political Sociology University of Minnesota Press, 1949, Arno Press, 1974, ISBN 0-405-05515-3 Sittlich Kate in Ziffern? Critic der Moralstatistik Morality in Numerics? Criticism of Morale Statistics 1928 Patriotismus, Prolegomena zu seiner Soziologischen Analyse Patriotism, Prolegomena to his Sociological Analysis 1929 Einfluss der Faschistischen Arbeitsverfassung auf die Weltwirtschaft Influence of the Fascist Arbeitsverfassung on the World Economy 1929 Italian von Hüt. Politische und wirtschaftliche Kulturgeschichte von 1860 bis 1930, Italy Today, Political and Economical Cultural History from 1860 to 1930, 1930 Introduzioni alla storia della dottrine economica e politische, Introduction to the History of Economic and Political Doctrines, 1932, Boicotaggio, Saggio su un aspetto della crisi, Boycotts, An Essay on an Aspect of Crises, 1934, Boycottage International, International Boycotts, 1936 Studien und Untersuchungen zur internationalen Dogmengeschichte der Volkswirtschaft, with a foreword by Heinz Maus Popularization Theory, Studies and Research into International Dogmas History of National Economy 1970, Elite e, O Demokratia Elites and or Democracy G. Volk, 1972 Ontologia di scritti sociologici Anthology of Publications on Sociology, edited by Giordano Sivini 1980 Works on Paper, 1918-1930 Barbara Mathis Gallery, 1984 Critique du Socialisme, Contribution aux Debats du Debat du ex siècle Critique of Socialism, Contributions to the Debates at the Start of the Twentieth Century, Articles Selected and Presented by Pierre Cors Salles and Jean-Marie Vincent Editions Kimé, 1992, ISBN 2-908212-43-9 Topic References for a critique of Mickles See Colin Barker Robert Mickles and the Cruel Game in Colin Barker et al. eds. Leadership and Social Movements Manchester, Manchester University Press, 2001. Robert Mickles and the Iron Law of Oligarchy, Chapter 12 of Revolution and Counterrevolution, Change and Persistence in Social Structures by Seymour Martin Lipset and Twicklung Zum Fascistischen Führerstadt in der Politischen Philosophie von Robert Mickles by Frank Fetch 1965 Robert Mickles, VOM Sozialistisch Syndicalistischen Zum Fascistischen Credo by Wilfred Rorick Dunker and Humblot, 1971, ISBN 3-428-02610-1 Organizzazioni, Partito, Class, Politica e Leg Feria dell'Oligarchia in Roberto Michels by Giorgio Sola 1972 Sociology and Estrangement, Three Sociologists of Imperial Germany by Arthur Mitzman Knopf, 1973, ISBN 0-394-44604-6 Republished with a new introduction by the author Transaction Books, 1987, ISBN 0-88738-605-9 the Anti-Democratic Sources of Elite Theory, Pareto, Mosca, Michels by Robert A. Nye Sage, 1977, ISBN 0-8039-9872-4.
Dilemmi della Democrazia Moderna, Max Weber e Robert Michels by Francesco Tacari, La Terza, 1993, ISBN 88 420 4243 9, Intellectuales, Masses y Alites, Una Introducione a Mosca, Pareto y Michels by Maria de los Angeles Januzzi, UNR Editora, 1993, ISBN 950 673 041 5. Robert Michels, Die Herausbildung der modernen politischen Soziologie im Kontext von Herius Fordering und Defizit der Arbeiterbewegung by Joachim Hetcher Robert Michels und das Eisern Gesetz der Oligarchie by Gustav Wagner in Wer Walt, Hat sein Stimme abjegeben. Grasswurzel Revolution pp. 28 Federico Trocini, Tra Internationalismo e Nationalismo. Robert Michels e I Dilemmi del Socialismo di Front alla Guerra e all'Imperialismo 1900-1915, Arachne, Roma 2007. Federico Trocini, Irredentismo e Patriotismo nella Celta Italiana di Robert Michels 1895-1915, un Arcana Affinita Elidiva, in Annali dell'Istituto Italo Germanico in Trento, 33, 2007, pp. 449-490. Federico Trocini, Robert Michels, Un Marxista Eteridasso al Tempo della Seconda Internazionale, 1900-1910, in Poggio pp. A Cura di, La Trinovecento. Communismo Eritico e Pensiera Critico, 5 Vol, Jacca Book, Milano 2010, Volume 1 Leda del Communismo Sovietico. Europa 1900-1945, pp. 305-319. Jennet, Tim, Der Fremd im Krieger, zur Politischen Theorie und Biographie von Robert Michels 1876-1936, 2008, 1 ISBN 978-3-05-004408-8 Jennet, Tim, HRSG, Robert Michels, Soziale Bewegungen zwischen Dynamik und Erstaring, Essays zur Arbeiter, Frauen und Nationalen Bewegung, 2008. ISBN 978-3-05-004388-3 Jennet, Tim, Antiquirder Klassiker? Zum Eidengeschichtlichen Status von Robert Michels Soziologie des Partusens, in, Blum, Fischer, Lanke, H.G., Eidenpolitik, Berlin 2011, S.383-296 Jennet, Tim, Demokratische Sozialpädagogik in der Kreis der Aklärung, zur Ambivalenz eines Klassikers der Leittheorie, in, Blum, Krause, H.G., Robert Michels Soziologie des Partusens, Wiesbaden 2012, S69-85, Jennet, Tim, Letter D. Lat Ladislaus Gumplowitz a Roberto Michels 1902-1907, in, Anneli della Fondazione Luigi Inaudi, Vol. 31, Torino 1997, S417-473. Jennet, Tim, Letter di Roberto Michels e di Julius Springer 1913-1915, in, Anneli della Fondazione Luigi Inaudi, Vol. XXX, Torino 1996, S. 533-555. Robert Michels Soziologie des Partusens, HRSGV. Harold Blum und Skadi Krause, Wiesbaden 2012 Topic. External links Biography of Robert Michels at bookrags.com Political Parties, a PDF of Political Parties. Robert Michels, Oligarchy Taken from Oscar Grusky and George A. Miller, The Sociology of Organizations, Basic Studies Free Press, 1970, pp. 25-43. Reprints from Political Parties. Roberto Michels, Oligarchy Comparison with Weber. Books and articles on, Robert Michels at Questia.